Hi guys, this is a little update to the NFT system that I've been building. I've actually redone it like four times in the last three weeks. I built it up a little bit. I had an A-frame on top of the pond, and I didn't like it because it uh, it takes too much pressure to raise that water up uh, in that little pipe. So I changed my hoses up. Right now, I'm only going with a uh, I think it's a 180 gallon per hour pump. It's a smaller pump um, and a flat system. So let me show you a couple things I have made mistakes doing on or considering the water. So <clears throat> first off, I thought it would be really cool or fancy to use one of these adjustable flow rate uh, sprinkler manifolds. I don't know what they're called. Something. Um, the water came out really, really slow. So I was like, man, I got to change this whole watering system. Um, I was going to go with the quarter inch, uh, like refrigerator hose type stuff. Oops, and I'm leaking right here. But what I decided to do was I went down and got some of the soft rubber. I mean, sorry. No, 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 no rubber um, hose. And it seemed to free up the water a lot more. So this flow rate is pretty good. Look at that. And now that I've got this flow rate going on compared to using this, like this is a lot more flow. These plants are actually growing. You can see there's a little bit of growth. These are kale. I'd say in two weeks it only had these two side. Since I got this flow rate going maybe four or five days ago, I've got this shoot. And most of them are getting that. Sorry if it doesn't clear up sometime soon oh well um, and also these were uh, these are red spinach or purple spinach they weren't showing any roots after a week get the flow rate right they start showing roots the next day uh, my beans they're not showing roots yet they uh, started showing roots in the humidity or the humidity dome and uh, I brought them out here so they haven't made much improvement the lettuce made huge improvements it made no roots with a slow flow rate. This is all from, this is all four days of this like great flow rate. I have everything flowing up to down, obviously. This is a little channel I just cut out of some three inch PVC drainage pipe and it flows right into my pond. I have a cover for the pond that uh, I need to recut this box on top is going to be for carrots this is going to be ebb and flow on a timer to flood three times a day i believe we'll figure that out when we get there but i have some little carrots going uh, i took them out of the humidity dome today just to throw them outside see what's going to happen uh, they like it out here it's a nice little windy day overcast so this is an update on what I have, uh, what I did with my flow rate or the rate of water flow or how to get it is I guess the better way to do it. Thanks for looking. Ask away if there's something I could help you on or if you see something I need to do or change about mine, let me know, like and subscribe. Thanks for checking me out. See you soon.